I'm Renee Charles with the Heartland Partnership and today we have with us Sue Arnhold from Haran Construction and we want to talk a little bit about the development sector of our community, commercial real estate, commercial development, commercial construction. What can you tell us about what we're seeing right now, just an overview of what your industry is going through? Right now we're seeing some good interest. We have multiple national firms that are interested in coming to Peoria. Uh, we have different spots where we're seeing multiple tenants applying for lease. Really? So it's very upbeat for us. What do you think that is? Are people hearing that we are faring better than other places and thinking, hey, we want to go there? Or what is it that's drawing people here? I think because we didn't have the, the high acceleration in value, we're not having the low dips. And so constantly, We've had a pretty constant economy, and um, um, we have great diversity of businesses here, so we don't rely on any one trade. Okay. So between that and our workforce, which is, I think, one of the best in the country. Right. Okay. Now, you had mentioned before we started this that there are four steps to a downturn economy. Um, kind of take me through that. Okay, in a downturn economy, the first thing to rebound, you have to first stabilize real estate values. Mm -hmm. Secondly, you have to stabilize your banking system. Mm -hmm. And right now, Peoria has done both of those. So we're already past step two. Step three is you need to create jobs. Mm -hmm. And number four is to stimulate the economy. So Peoria is already in place to start moving forward. And that gives us a great jump start on a lot of places around the country. And another jump start that we're going to be seeing, hopefully, is uh, from the president's stimulus package. And there is something set aside for uh, the development sector. Tell me a little bit about that. Well, for one thing is they're funding the states with energy packages so commercial real estate owners can, you know, go ahead and um, upgrade their energy efficiency in their plants and their businesses and this sort of thing. There's also potential tax relief. There's going to be uh, bonus depreciation, capital investments, and maybe a five-year carry back on business losses. So um, it's real conducive to business. And a lot of people when we talk about development, a lot of people are saying, yeah, but businesses are closing down, they're moving out of town, they're, they're shutting their doors. But at the same time, by having some of those vacancies, it's not all bad to have some vacancies. Because if someone calls and says, we'd like to locate to Peoria, we might have some available properties for them. Yes, right now is a great time to do something. Mm -hmm. Okay, we have good inventory. Mm -hmm. um, we have our lumber costs are as low as they were in 2004. Um, we have a great worker base. Mm -hmm. Um, we have a local college that's happy to work with employers mm -hmm. to train your employees or to retrain your employees. So we have what those people need. Yes, yeah, and, and the interest rate is as low as it's been since 71, so um, it's a great time to, to act and get busy. And you know, a lot of people are going to say, okay, it can't be all roses like that. Obviously, the sector has slowed down a little bit. There has been um, some, you know, some change in it because of the recession. Would you say that it has been a dramatic, uh, dramatic issue for this particular sector? We have not seen the real extremes that the rest of the country has. Um, we have about a hundred tenants, and we've lost one. Okay. Okay, because the business shut down, uh, slow down. But what we're seeing is that the companies are really becoming lean. Mm -hmm. They're getting rid of the average employees, so they're kind of shifting out of the dead weight. They're taking the, the above average person, and those are the people that are ramrodding ahead, and those are the people that are going to be our success, success and there's stories. No, with getting lean. no, none at all. Nobody has ever gone bankrupt from getting lean, but they sure have from enlarging too quickly. <laughs> uh, Sue Arnold, thanks so much from Haran Construction. We really appreciate you lending some insight into what's going on with the commercial real estate and commercial development here in the Peoria area. Thank you. Thanks.